The fierce fight for Donetsk International Airport over the winter of 2014-2015 became much more than a battle for a strategically important terminal complex. The outnumbered and outgunned Ukrainian soldiers inside the destroyed building earned the name Cyborgs by one member of the combined Russian army units and separatist forces for withstanding intense attacks for months before retreating. Their heroic stories are portrayed in the new film, Cyborgs. Actor Roman Yasunovsky plays a Ukrainian serviceman with the call sign Gid, which translates into English as guide. He says he began preparing for the role well before filming began. He says a week before filming, we met, rehearsed walking in uniform with automatic weapons. We practiced fighting techniques and the stunts that we made ourselves. Based on real events, the full-length feature film, made with the help of the cyborgs themselves, follows the individual stories of those who were deployed to the airport for the first time. A musician, a son of a wealthy family, ordinary people from different backgrounds, who all fight with one aim, for the future of their country and for their loved ones. In the film, the characters try to understand their role in the war and the price of independence. Our heroes put these questions to each other on Facebook, in personal conversations between people. That's why we voiced them, precisely because they wanted to shoot an honest movie. The creators hope that soon the movie Cyborgs will be seen in other countries. It is necessary that the whole world sees this. Because unfortunately the war is going on. Now there is interest in Poland, the Baltics and Canada. The film Cyborgs will go on general release this week.